In this question, we need to be able to understand what functions are and what they're used for. So 4a part i um, asks us to say what the parameters, one of the parameters used by this function. There's only one mark. There are actually two parameters to choose from, and we need to write down one of them. So here's our function. It's written in pseudocode. It's called isPrefix. And then inside the brackets, it takes two parameters, one called name and one called value. So parameters are things that let you customize your function. Remember, a function is something that does something useful, that calculates something and returns a value. Um, so it looks like this function returns either true or false. Um, and it has two bits of data that are passed to it, two bits of data that this function uses. One's called name and one's called value. So you could write down in here either name or value. Either of those would get you your mark. Then the next question, state the data type of name. So name is one of the parameters up here. We need to try and work out what data type it is. Um, so if we look at the function, we get some clues. Up here, we've got an if statement. It says if name and then square brackets one. And whenever you see square brackets, um, it's thinking that it's a list or an, an array. Um, so we're trying to find the first item in this, um, in this variable. Um, so... Uh, um, uh, you could write down that data type is an array or a list, um, or you could also say you get the marks for saying that it's a string, because a string is like an array of characters. So if name was a string, as in um, M-R space D-R-I-N-G, Mr. Dring, then name square brackets one would get the first item in that um, array, because in AQA pseudocode, one gets you the, the first value, not zero. Um, so you could write down either string or array or list. Um, any one um, of those would get you your, your marks. Um, state the data type of the return value. So the return value is what your function works out. So you need to work out um, what type of data is returned. And it either returns true or it returns false. So the type of that data is Boolean. And Boolean, remember, is either true or false. So in here we'd have to write Boolean.